Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Rodney, and I'm back, and I wanted to go ahead and give my take on the season 13 reunion, um, Real Housewives of Atlanta looks. Um, so the looks were released the other day. You know, they shot the reunion probably like a week or two ago. Um, and so, you know, usually they, you know, let us know how the girls, you know, how the girls pump through the building before the reunion actually airs. Um, I think this year's theme was the dungeon. Um, I read somewhere that the colors were, um, they had a choice between like black and red and another, another color, but I don't know, but everybody ended up wearing black. So I'm just going to assume the color was black. <clears throat> For the most part, you know, there were some hits. <laughs> there definitely were some misses. Some of y'all friends looked a mess. <laughs> Girl looked a mess. Hello. <laughs> Let's get into it because I want to upload pictures. And anytime I upload pictures, it takes forever for um, my videos to... Not upload, but when I do it like through iMovie, it takes forever for the video to complete for me to for me to upload it. So I know since I have a few pictures, and this one is gonna take probably like 30 minutes. Alright, y'all. So let's get into it. We're gonna start out. What time is it? What time is it, y'all? 2.42? Oh, okay. I got I got enough time. Okay. Cause I also want to talk about uh what's that girl name? What's that girl name? La Uzi? La Uzi Verb? The one who JT talked to. I want to talk about them um, in another video. All right, so we're going to start out with my least favorite to the ones who I thought, like, shut it down. Hello? Now, listen. My least favorite. I really, 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 really tried to get into this woman's look. I really tried to. I went to her personal Instagram page. I was looking at the videos that she posted and I was like turning my head sideways. Like, you know, it's actually kind of cute. No, I'm trying to make it cute. No, it's cute. No, girl, you trying to make it cute. No, it's cute. It wasn't cute to me. We're going to go ahead and give it who, who look like a goddamn fool. Girl, where is you going? Girl, that's going to be the title of this video. Girl, where is you going? Girl, Candy Sugar Mama Birds. Shout out to Erica. Candy Sugar Mama Birds looked an absolute mess. I'm sorry. I tried to get into Candy's look. Y'all know I like Candy. I follow Candy on Instagram. Uh, but Candy looked a fool. I get what she was going for. I get what she was going for. I think that she was more... I think Candy was probably more in a business mode. If that makes sense, like, because, you know, she does the dungeon parties and, you know, now the best, I think she does bachelorette parties now. Um, so she's probably like, oh, let me continue to promote uh, my brand, what I do. So from a business standpoint, if that's what she was thinking, it completely makes sense. But just from a fashion standpoint, like, girl, this is not a Halloween costume. Girl, candy, girl, we get it, girl. You're going to get to the money. <laughs> Show you how to get to the money. Come on and get this. Oh, shout out to Nene, girl. I wonder if she filed for unemployment yet. Um, but anyways, so Candy, I didn't like. You know, I, I just don't think Candy and this. I don't. I, I don't want this to sound mean. Candy is a very pretty woman. She has a nice body. Even though I think if she keep on, she's gonna be shaped like Shakana. Because Candy don't like to work out, but she has let it, let us know that she has gotten like I think tummy tuck and liposuction, which is fine. But girl, she if she keep going, I think she's gonna be shaped like Shakana, just with a flat stomach and just keep eating and eating and eating and eating. You getting big, but you want to keep getting your stomach sucked out, but everything else is getting big. <laughs> Candy doesn't have what it takes to pull off something that sexy. Like, you really have to be a girl of a certain, with a certain confidence and a certain walk and a certain, just, to just pull something like that off. And I don't think she got, I don't think she has that in her to pull something like that off. There are other girls 
who probably could have probably could have walked through the building and girl sold it. She just didn't sell it to me. She just did not sell it. Okay, who's next? Um, the next person, Shamia. <laughs> Shamia, I, I'm sorry. Um, Shamia is a gorgeous woman. You know, she's dumb, but nonetheless gorgeous. Dumb over her friendship with Portia. But I did not like this dress. Hold up. Let me look at Candy one more time. <clears throat> Candy had on fishnet stockings. Yeah, I'm gonna post a picture. Y'all can see it. Mm -mm. Next case, <laughs> Shamia. Shamia gave me coming to America teas. I didn't like it. Her dress looks her dress looks very, very cheap to me. It looks very, very cheap. I, I just put some lotion on my face. My face ashy. Damn. Damn my lotion in the room. Her face, I mean her face. Um her hair. And this is the thing. When I'm looking at people, I'm looking at the whole picture. I'm looking at the hair, the makeup, the dress. Her makeup is nice. Her hair is decent. It's big. I don't like this dress. This dress gives me very, get, gives me very Forever 21-ish. It does. It looks cheap. The material looks cheap. From what I can see, the material looks very, very cheap. I don't like it. I didn't like it. Next, who? Y'all, y'all, y'all best friend, Drew. Drew did not look bad, okay? Now, this is where, this is where the fashions, in my opinion, start to get a little bit better. My top two, the top one who just looked a complete disaster was Candy. Shamia, I just didn't like. Drew don't look bad. This is where we start to get into like, okay, girl, y'all look decent. Hold up. Because I ain't got no pants on. Shit. <laughs> Get her up. Girl, because I don't put no lotion on my face. This is going to bother me. Okay. I feel like. I feel like I look a whole lot better. Girl, y'all know I'm about to start trying to get my skin and my teeth and all that shit together, girl. I got an appointment for my braces. Y'all know I'm about to get braces again. Girl, y'all, I'm so, girl, I gotta get my teeth together, girl. And I gotta get my skin together. Like right here, these two bags that be sitting right here be killing me softly. I need to start drinking more water. Y'all y'all swerving down water is the key for every motherfucking thing, so. Girl, I'm about to get it. All right, y'all. So, Drew. Drew. Um, This is one thing I don't like about when people wear short dresses and then try to have that long... It's like... It, I don't... I, I, it always looks like to me somebody just attached a piece of fabric on someone's dress to give it, I guess, a different feel or vibe. Drew's dress is, I don't think, I think it ages her. I think Drew's dress ages her. Her hair is slicked back. She's a pretty girl. It's not a bad dress. It's not a bad dress. She doesn't look horrible. It's her first reunion. She's cute. I'm going to give Drew cute. Candy, where is you going? Shamia, where is you going? Girl. Drew is cute. I, I feel like this dress is a little bit too old for Drew, though. But Drew got an old spirit. I don't give a damn with nobody. She messy as fuck. Yeah. So, Drew is next. All right. Who next on the hit list? Okay. Now, this person, Marlo Hampton. 
for some reason, for Marlo to be the fashion girl, Marlo always gets it. Well, not always, because she's been cute. Marlo never just, you know what it is with Marlo in the in the reunions? She never just gives me what I need. Like, she never just gives me, like, bitch, Marlo came and shut it down. Like, Marlo, you supposed to be the fashion girl. You should, you're supposed to walk into the reunion and shut that shit down because you the fashion girl. But every reunion is just like, oh. <laughs> like, I think last year, was it last year? I thought Marlo looked a mess. I think my favorite dress that Marlo had on was that purple, that lavender tulle dress. And that to me was a more, that dress sitting down, I thought Marlo looked horrible. Standing up, I thought she looked, and that's the thing what people need to realize. Some dresses, some things look great when you're sitting down. Some things look great when you're standing up. Some things look great if you're being um, photographed. Some things look great. When you walk into a room and the light hits you like, ooh, bitch was bad. But then it's like, oh, girl, that dress actually look a mess. So I think that sometimes dresses are meant for certain things and can do certain things. Um, Marlo just was naked. Just, Marlo just was naked. She had a leather something over her chest. She just was naked. It just, it just like some, it really looked like Marlo got, uh, got um, some fabric wrapped it around her waist and threw a bathing suit top on. That's what it looks like to me. But it's cute in a sexy way. I done said all that to say this. It's cute in a sexy way. It's just that I just, I don't like it for Marlo. That's what it is. But I guess it's cute though. See, this is the thing, too. This is how people get themselves in trouble because we, and then her, her makeup is nice. Her hair is nice, even though her and Cynthia had the same goddamn wig. Her hair is nice. Her makeup is nice. I think what it is for me, I just expect more from Marlo. And she always lets me down. All right, who's next? Oh, I saw some people online saying that they didn't like this person dress. Latoya. Latoya was cute. Latoya was cute. Latoya was young. She was, it looked, it, it looked just, it looked young. It looked fresh. It looked um, age appropriate. Where like Marlo's to me, I'm sorry, did not look age appropriate. I know I hate, we, I hate to say that, but it just is what it is. Um, the only thing I did not like about um, Latoya's get up is I don't like the fact that you can see her panties. Like, I think she should have had found some clear underwear or probably didn't put the girl just came through with no panties on at all, girl. But I don't like the fact that I can see her um, underwear. Other than that, you know, and I usually have a thing when Pete, when it looks like people attach fabric to dresses, just like Drew. But in this case, it doesn't look bad. I think, I think Latoya looks very nice. She has a very pretty face. I love her with the black hair. She looks cute. Latoya looks cute. Now, this is my top three. Y'all already know who the top three is. Cynthia, Kenya, Portia. Now, this is the thing with Cynthia, Kenya, and Portia. They really look like they could be in a group. <laughs> Girl. D Destiny Shout, hello. Their dresses were different, but they were very similar. It almost looked like the same designer in the same collection. Like, this is my collection for fall. Twin, like, this is my collection, my new collection called The Dungeon. You see what I'm saying? Their dresses looked almost the same. Cynthia. Cynthia was cute. I did not like her hair. I did not like her hair with that dress. I just didn't. I don't know why. I didn't like Cynthia's hair with that dress. To me, you know what Cynthia gives me? Cynthia is another one that never just wows me at the reunions. And I think, I finally think I got to figure it out. 
I think because Cynthia was a supermodel and Cynthia has probably tried on every dress known to mankind, girl, that she doesn't, it's kind of like, girl, I done put all the dresses on. I done walked in all the runways, girl. I know all the designers. Girl, just give me a dress so I can guard her and do this reunion. That's how I think Cynthia probably looks at it. Cynthia was cute. Now, my top two, bitch. That motherfucking Porsche in that motherfucking Porsche in Kenya, bitch, did not come to play no motherfucking games. <laughs> now just listen to me and listen to me good because I know some of y'all girls about to start. Porsche, absolutely stunning. Nothing I can say about Porsche. <laughs> the bitch, absolutely stunning. <laughs> Hair, makeup, dress, jewelry. The bitch, I love her with the short hair. I hope she don't go back to long hair. Porsche looks absolutely gorgeous with the short hair. Kenya, absolutely stunning. Bitch look young and youthful. Girl, I live. Girl, I live for Miss, Miss USA. Kenya is my favorite, right? And I'll tell you why. Portia, absolutely gorgeous, absolutely stunning, all of the above. But this dress does remind me of the dress she wore at Cynthia's wedding. When I look at Kenya, and somebody said this to me in my DMs, and she, I read exactly what she said. We've never seen Kenya, like, in a black dress, right? Um... So it was just like, oh, Kenya has on her black dress. We know that's the, we know that's the, that was the dress code. But like, oh, Kenya has on a black dress. You know, she got her up. Okay, Kenya's gorgeous. With, with Portia, it's like, oh, she's gorgeous. Oh, I've seen that dress before. Girl. To me, to, honestly, it almost looked just like Portia got the same dress out of her closet, closed the split up, girl, and put a sleeve on it. That's really the only difference. That doesn't take away from how, you know, how gorgeous she looks, but this dress that Portia has on, it really looks like, oh, it looks like, again, it looks like the dress that Portia wore at Cynthia's wedding, this dress, Kenya's dress, and Cynthia's dress all came from the same designer, all came from the same collection. That's what I'm trying to say. But Kenya is my favorite. Kenya never really disappoints at the reunion. One thing I can give Kenya, when it comes when it comes when it comes time for reunions, baby my mama used to be on point. Kenya looks damn good. Kenya looks great. But yeah, Portia and Kenya were my top two. I just I just wish Portia's dress didn't look so similar to the one that she wore to Cynthia's um wedding. Because it feels like even though that wedding was way, what, last year, because we just saw the episode, it feels like we just saw her in the same dress. All right, y'all, that's it. I'm done. Let me try to upload these pictures because it's going to take forever. All right, bye, y'all.